Good morning, baby. Did you have a good sleep? No, you didn't. You needed to get out. Uh, oh. <laughs> Love her furrowed brow. It looks like she has a unibrow when she does that. It's so funny. Uh, uh, Here's your zebra. Uh, Oh, mm. kisses to the zebra. Eh. Yeah. Eh. Are you ready to get go upstairs? Eh. She moves around so much that we have to put this on her. I wish she'd freeze, and then we just put this crochet blanket my aunt made for Josiah. She sleep with that too. There's. Ready to go upstairs and eat some breakfast? No. You just want to play? Yeah. Da. 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 Does that work? Yeah. Where? <laughs> yeah. Hey. Mimi. Good morning. So, this morning. For today, I really wanted to go um, shopping for the rest of the kids' uh, uh. birthday party, but that might not happen. My kitchen's a mess, by the way. I haven't been home all day yesterday. Um, I'm trying to grab this stuff. Uh. I'm just kind of bummed because of the snow. I mean, not because of the snow. I'm bummed because... Um, we can't get our car out because we live down a hill. And we can't get our car out because it's too slippery. There's just too much slush and snow to get out. And then once you get to the top of the hill, that's not, um, the snow plows don't come through there because it's just a small private street. And, uh, and I asked Ben to grab me a shovel when he went to his parents' house and he forgot. So I'm going to check to see if we still, if we have one in the back. I don't know. Eh? I wanted to try and shovel a nice path so that we can get out today, but I think it's just be too much time, and um, we don't even know if we're going to have Bible study tonight, and I need to know if, we need, if we're going to have Bible study because I'm cooking potatoes, because we're having a potato bake, baked potato bar food thing. You want me to put you down? Uh. No. Hey. Uh. Hmm. Uh. Hmm. Uh. Huh. Uh. She slept really well last night. I'm going to put you down, my girl. And we didn't do hardly anything around the house yesterday. We did nothing around the house yesterday. Um, because we went sliding all day long, and it was so much fun. It was like Ben and like three other families, and then somebody, and an extra person. So, I mean, we had like, what, nine adults and nine kids? Um, at this house, and we just all kind of hung out and went sledding, and I'm pretty sore from it. I didn't s go sledding for very long, or tobogganing, whatever you want to call it. Um, and I am sore. I only went in the morning, went down probably about like five, six times, and I was done. And so I decided just to stay there at the house to see, try and get Eden to take a nap, so that she wouldn't be so grouchy. She ended up not sleeping anyway, but it was her, Josiah, and Josiah's little best friend. And, uh, somebody else came to hang out with me the whole time, and it was fun. It was really fun. Um, the boys had a lot of fun, Ben and his friends, and I wish we would have gotten some video recording of it, but I didn't. Oh, I'm so bummed. But we did. There was some, uh, clips that I got. I guess I can insert them. I don't know. Um, it's really cool because we don't normally get snow like this in Oregon probably once every three to four years um, so yeah Ben had so much fun taking Josiah sledding down the hill and yeah we just watched the two littlest boys pretty much and eat and, and let everyone else go have fun which I was okay with because just able to sit there watch a movie and chat and you know have a little bit of a uh, adult drinks <laughs> And relax. It was really, really fun. <laughs> mm, this is what I'm talking about. See, it's all slush right there. 
and we just can't get our car up that hill. <laughs> it's just, it's just gonna sit there for a little while. Poor thing. So that's a bummer. And it's cold today. It's a lot colder than it was yesterday. Where are you going, baby? No? I'm not going anywhere? I gotta shut this gate because you like to try and go downstairs. The kids are playing right now. And I'm just <sighs> waiting for an answer <laughs> on if we're going to be having our Bible study tonight or not. What's, what's wrong? Me. That is you. You're right. That is you. Say, that's me, Josiah. Can you say your name? Josiah. <laughs> um, because if not, then maybe we can schedule an appointment to go see a duplex that's a little bit bigger than ours. Um, it's a three-bedroom duplex, and it has a garage and a yard that's fenced and a cul-de-sac, and it's just something we're looking for. It's in our price range, so, um, yeah, it would be really nice to get that. And we were, we really want to get Eden a new crib, but I don't want to set up a new crib. <laughs> what is that look? <laughs> I don't want to set up a new crib in Josiah's room if we're going to be moving. So, um, we're waiting to get a crib. So, Eden still needs a crib. She needs a new car seat, a larger car seat, because she's still in her infant one. She fits in it fine, it's just she's starting to get a little scrunched, like her legs are kind of like up against her. <laughs> Not very comfortable. So just a crib and a car seat soon. Uh -huh. So as soon as we get some answers, we're just like, we're just waiting to see if we can get that place. If we can just look at it. I just want to look at it just to see what it looks like because, wow, my hair looks lovely, doesn't it? Um, there was another place we were looking at and it ended up not going through. We were, you know, offered it and at first Ben sent an email saying that we didn't want it and then we changed our minds and the email didn't send anyway. And then we woke up the next morning and the email ended up sending and the lady already got back to us saying, okay, we'll go to the next person then. So it looks like that, that place really wasn't meant for us, which is okay. It was like a lot smaller and although it had like a yard and a garage, it just was too small on the inside. The rooms were too small. There was... Yes, that's a binky. You can let Eden have it if you want. Would you like to give it to Mimi? So, it's it feels like that when you're waiting for, for you know, like to move out or to get something, you're always waiting for one person or one thing um, to happen, and then as soon as something happens, it just kind of flows and falls right into place the way you need it to. I'm prepared to stay here, but it would be really nice to have a yard for the summer, so I can just let Josiah play and Eden play in the backyard, turn on the water, let them play with the water, um, and if we were to move in this place, we'd be living there for quite a while, just because, um, we would be paying off debt living there, and we would be uh, saving to buy a house. No, you don't need a binky. Take it out of your mouth. It's not good for your teeth. Take it out of your mouth, please. Thank you. You're a big boy. You don't need a binky. Yeah. <laughs> um, so, yeah, that's what I'm waiting for today. I'm, I don't know when I'm going to be able to take a shower today, though. That is a problem. Um... I'm trying to stretch out Eden's nap so that she doesn't, so she gets closer and closer to napping at like noon. Because Josiah goes down for quiet time around noon or uh, 12.30. <clears throat> so, right now I'm just kind of cleaning up around the house and uh, I just got done stuffing diapers. I'm going to start another little laundry and you can hear I have the TV on as a distraction for the kids. Eden's just playing and eating. He's eating Josiah's banana. He's like, Mom, I don't want this. I'm like, well, give it to eat Mimi. <laughs> he just gives it to her. She's just chowing down on it. Well. <laughs> so today I'm just waiting for one person, and then we'll be waiting for another person <laughs> to uh, get some answers. This is what I'm having for lunch. Well, kind of lunch. I didn't really have breakfast. I have like, I have coffee in the morning, so I'm not really hungry for breakfast, so I just kind of, uh, you know, wait till closer to lunch to eat. So, yeah, this is what I'm having for lunch. Josiah and I will probably end up sharing it. 
having just a cheese omelet. That's only two eggs, guys. Seriously? Two eggs and it makes that huge of an omelet. Like, it's not really thin either. So, that's what I'm going to have for lunch with Josiah. Little boogers eating all my food. Sucker face. And a hat. Yeah, you do have a hat on, huh? No, a ball. And soccer? Ball. Soccer ball. He's been eating all my food, which is good. He needs to eat something else besides <laughs> suckers. Yeah, he gets a he gets a sucker if he goes poo in the potty. Which it's we're trying to get to become a more normal thing for him. And uh, once it becomes more regular, then we won't be rewarding him because then it just becomes like a regular habit. So he doesn't get suckers very often, probably once a week. <laughs> But today he just kind of went by himself. I didn't have to bug him about it, and he got a sucker for it. Hi, huh, buddy. Hi. Are you all done? I'm all done. All done. Okay. Thank you for eating a lot. I might just skip lunch for him. I might just give him a, some milk and have him go to bed. So today, instead of um, having dinner at our Bible study, I uh, hear Eden. She just went down for a nap, and she's just doesn't want to sleep very well right now. What, buddy? I don't know what you're saying. Buddy, not right now, okay? Can you find your trains? Where's your train? Where's your trains at? Okay. Anyway, we're instead of doing dinner at Bible study, which we were planning on doing, we're just gonna have it. And I think whoever shows up shows up, and I think they just might ha hang out because there was no church yesterday, um, so there really isn't anything to discuss or talk about. Um, and then around six or seven tonight, Ben and I are gonna go out and see the house. Finally, get a hold of the lady <laughs> and have to get my mom out of her driveway because I guess she's stuck, which I don't quite understand. Um, yeah, I don't. Because <laughs> for us, we can, if we just shovel the driveway all the way up to the main road, we'll be fine. We just can't get out of our driveway because it's a, it's a slanted hill. And, uh, maybe she just has the same problem. I don't know. Um, so that's what we're probably going to be doing today is taking people out of their driveways. <laughs> and I think maybe she was asking me because Ben has his four-wheel drive truck and might be able to pull her out. Yeah, you hear Mimi? Do we need to go get her? Okay, let's go get her. <laughs> get her. Careful with the mess at the bottom of the stairs. Okay. Okay. It's all very safe, isn't it? <laughs> Let me take this down anyway. The white warmer. Okay, where's she at? Mimi! Mimi! Are you ready to get out? Okay. Okay. Oh. You ready to get out? Come here. There you go. Boop. Oh, buddy. Hey, we don't swing that. Mimi's. She's tired. This is our room that we don't sleep in. <laughs> it's always messy. But like we said, we're kind of almost in the middle of moving. So it's going to be messy for a while. <gasps> Baby girl, here's your zebra. Zebra. Yeah. You want to go eat some lunch? Okay, buddy. I think we're going to start getting you ready for nap time. You got a messy, nasty shirt and I got to get more laundry done. <clears throat> So I wanted to show you guys what exactly I wanted to do for the kids' dressers. This is actually my old dresser that I got as a child. <laughs> and my mother gave it to me, gave it back to me, I guess. All those stickers there need to be taken off. And I looked on Pinterest and Google to see how to just kind of take care of linoleum and how to paint over it. So the, the couple websites that I saw said just basically use primer to paint the whole thing even if it's white and then paint whatever color you want. 
So I'm still unsure if I want to do that because if you could see down here, it's cracked on this side and then right here it's not cracked. So if my husband can fix that, then I'll redo this dresser. But if not, then we'll just toss it and get her, find something else for her. Um, I'm not going to sit there and spend all this time it, when there's you know something broken that we can't fix it. Um, it's still really sturdy. It's a nice sturdy dresser. Um, this was one of the dressers like when you buy it, it's good and sturdy and it lasts forever. Um, what? I don't know what you're saying. Okay, so that's Eden's dresser. What? You want to dance? Yeah. Okay, should we turn on some music then? Yes. Alright, let's find some music. Let's see here. Mommy doesn't quite know. Song? Okay, you just turn it off. Alright, let's figure this thing out. Is that better? Okay. So that's Eden's dresser that we're wanting, that I'm wanting to do, maybe not do, really depends what happens. Over here, I'm gonna go in Josiah's room where Eden's playing. Hi. And his dresser's right here. It's kind of dark, I'm sorry guys, there really isn't much light in here. This is Ben's old dresser, and I asked if I can refurbish this thing, and it's, I hate the color of the wood, and <laughs> this thing might take a lot of work, or we'll see. Um, so like this whole thing it's really good sturdy the only problem is this part right here is also cracked just like on mine don't know why they do that but um this dresser i would love to keep just because it's ben's old dresser he's had it forever it's more sentimental to him um a lot of these knobs are falling off we have them all over the house josiah likes to use them so what i want to do with this one is paint it like a gray or a navy blue color and then get some new knobs for it maybe some kind of like sailor or cars or something like that put on there so I'll probably redo that dresser I definitely want to keep that one for sure and try to uh, you know fix it up and make it look nice hey baby are you trying to play here it's learning time <gasps> there's Purple, Ooh. blue, green, red. <laughs> yeah, we're waiting for your mac and cheese to cool. Why don't you take off your gloves and go wash up? Let's go wash your hands, buddy. Mimi's eating some oranges. I'm waiting for her mac and cheese to cool, too. That's all we're really having for dinner. That's all I could find. Because of the... Because of the storm and everything, we haven't had time to go out to go shopping. No sucker, we're gonna go wash our hands and eat mac and cheese. Yes. Yes. Homemade mac and cheese is a favorite in our house, huh? Yeah. Yeah. I feel bad there really isn't anything else I can give them right now, but that's okay. We're going out and probably grab like a burger or something, like a cheap thing. <laughs> we need to go grocery shopping, huh, buddy? So we're all as a family going to go look at a duplex, huh, buddy? Yeah. So just waiting for Daddy to eat and get out of the shower. 